Hey folks, Michael A. Chanson, short story writer here again. It's still Halloween Eve. I'd like to uh, pitch another one of my short stories to you, and it's in an anthology I was really proud to be a part of. Um, Chud Lives, compiled by Eric S. Brown. And I'll read some of the author's names. Actually, I'll read them all. Uh, they show first initials as opposed to last names. But uh, J.G. Faraday, M. Powell, B. Fisher, M. Castle, J. Mayberry, I think you know who that is, uh, E. Johnson, J. White, uh, Chad Lutsky, so that was C. Lutsky, R. Baxter, P. C. Perrin, D. Bernstein, N. Cato, A. Layborn, uh, M. H. Hansen, or Michael A. Hansen, myself, uh, C. Fulbright, A. Hawks, D. Robbins, R. Waters, G. Mitchell, uh, T. Wagner, R. C. Thomas, and uh, guest stars were the famous science fiction author David Drake, who's also uh, a fantasy author. He's a novelist, a uh, very well known writer. And then I believe uh, the screenwriter and a producer of the movie Chud uh, also have uh, it's an interview for one and a little right up by another, uh, P. Hall and A. Bonhomme. Uh, sorry, I did more. Didn't have more expansive credits to read off to you. That's uh, what was on this cover of it. So Chud lives, you know, C period H-U-D, cannibalistic humanoid undergrad or dweller. This uh, was a tribute anthology. So the stories are a mix of stories that take place during the movie, like uh, different scenes. Like there's a scene of a woman walking a dog near the beginning. Well, there's a story written about that. So you kind of know a little bit more about those two characters. Those of you who have seen the movie, Chud, know, knows what happens to them, but this is more background. And there's just, like I said, different characters, little background characters in the movie that suddenly have their own short story in this. Um, my own short story uh, takes place in uh, you know, a tower, uh, a high-rise uh, that people live in. And my story picks up exactly where the movie Chud ends, so I like to think of it as a, a sequel. And when I wrote my story, I wanted it to be to Chud what Aliens was to Alien. So there's a lot of Chud in my story and there's a lot of action, a lot of fighting, and uh, I really think you'll enjoy it. And I think you'll enjoy this, especially if you're a fan of the movie Chud and or movies like Chud. This, uh, this, this book has a lot of love in it. You know, myself, all these other authors, you know, we fell in love with this movie when we saw it. I saw it on the big screen when I was in film school back in the 80s. Other people that you know watch it on video, DVD, and recently streaming, and uh, we all got together, and, and this thing was made. Uh, I think it's a lot of fun. I think it's great to read on Halloween Eve, or even tomorrow at Halloween, or basically at any time. It's a great collection of short stories, and uh, one by myself. So to show you again, Chud Lives. Uh, it's uh, available in trade paperback, and it's also available in ebook. Um, sure how well you can see this the light glare off of that uh, but that's it chud lives want to beware of chud on halloween so have a good one